Morning everyone, it's time for Shared Story Time. Today, Kyra and I have a really beautiful book of mindfulness and it's called I Am Peace. It's a book by Susan Verdi and the art or illustrations are by Peter H. Reynolds. Now, story time is a really great way uh, to talk about things like mindfulness or to teach or encourage children about all those skills that they need to be present and to take in everything around them. I'm sure at home you guys have lots of great ways to do that with your family and we'd love to hear how you incorporate mindfulness into your day or into your routine with children. What's something we like to do, Kai, when we're outside or in a nice moment? We do the five... Do the five senses. So we like to look around and see what we can smell and see and hear and taste and feel, don't we? We all like to list them. And then that, that's a little brief moment in the day to help us be mindful. Let's see what this story says. Are you ready? Yeah? Yeah. There are times when I worry about what might happen next and what happened before. The thoughts in my head are like rushing water and I feel like a boat with no anchor. Doesn't look good, does it? Being carried away. I give myself a moment. I take a breath and then I tell myself it's all right. I feel the ground beneath my feet and steady myself and start to notice the here and now. My thoughts begin to settle. My mind begins to clear. I am peace. I wonder how that feels. I can watch my worries gently pop and disappear. I let things go. I can say what I feel inside out loud. I know myself. I can share kindness with others. I make a difference. What's he doing here? Feeding the birds. Oh, plop. He can see all the bird seed dropping. Maybe he can hear it. Oh, he can feel the sand. He can see things growing. What's that? That's his pants. Why's there feet on it? Why is there feet on it? Because feet come out of your pants. Because <laughs> pants go on your legs. He's noticing all the things happening around him. I can hug a tree and thank it for its beauty and strength. I can connect to nature. I can watch the clouds make shapes against the sky. I know wonder. He's watching the clouds for interesting shapes. I can taste and smell and touch and hear and see what is all around me. I use my senses like we do. I can feel my breath, feel my whole body. I tune into me. He does look peaceful, doesn't he? Yeah. Now the water is still. I have found my anchor and everything is all right. I don't need to worry about before or after. I am in this moment. I am peace. Now I share my peace with others and hope that it is carried away to those who need it. And I dream that we are peace. What a beautiful story, isn't it? Yeah. So he used his senses and he took in all of the things that were happening around him and connecting with nature. What do you do to find peace or to do some mindfulness in your home or in your life? Thanks for joining us today for that beautiful story. And we look forward to reading a new story with you next time. Bye, everyone.